welcome everyone in today's video we will look at how to remote the dotnet sdk using the dotnet uninstall tool on the mac os You need to download the .NET install tool. I have uh, pasted the link in the description. Create a directory, and then you need to extract the tar file uh, into the directory. So on Mac, when you download, it's a GZ that it, it will unzip, and you will see a tar file in your download folder. Extract it using this command: tar minus exif. Then in the folder you will see one tool installed. It has couple of options. Minus H will give you the list of commands that are available. You have list, a dry run, and a remove. Let's look at a list of SDKs and runtimes that are available. We're so looking at removing the 3.1.4.1 uh, in this video. Let's confirm with the .NET command. We have 3.1.401 SDK is installed. Let's first do, uh, do a dry run with a version. Dry run will not remove any files. It will only uh, tell you if there are any issues. Install dry run three one four zero one. Okay, we need to specify whether it's a runtime or an SDK. If you accidentally say runtime, you will see that it throws up an error because there's no runtime with three one four zero one. We only have the SDK. Yeah, this uh, removal requires. Uh, you to be uh, uh, administrator that is one thing and the second thing is this will break if you have Visual Studio for Mac installed so I don't have Visual Studio for Mac installed I had installed directly the SDK so I can go ahead and remove if you have Visual Studio for Mac then uh, don't use this uh, uh, remove it but if, if you do it it, it will break So with the force command, just going ahead and removing the SDK. Confirm. It says used by Visual Studio for Mac. Uh, I don't have it installed on my Mac. Uh, I had it installed, removed it. So this uninstalls the uh, SDK 31401. Let's confirm with the .NET command. There you go. We don't have it right now. The download link for the uninstall tool and the links for documentation are uh, provided in the description. Refer the same. Thank you for watching this video. Have a good day.